We'll see if Frank answers my phone call. Let's see if he answers. My God! Douglas, good soul. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, long time no chat. We've been staying out of trouble. I, I think that's a maturity factor. What do you think? Mm. No, that's why I'm calling you. I think we're getting in trouble again. <laughs> How bad is this, Douglas? Uh, it does involve hundreds of thousands of dollars. I'm in court at a, at a ridiculous case at two o'clock. Oh, do you want to? Um, do you want to? Do you want to tell? Do you want to tell us about it? It's 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 all it's about uh, two prostitutes. That's all. Ooh. Really? See now now we have your attention. Right? You absolutely <laughs> do. Wait wait. Are they accused of being prostitutes? Or are these or is, or are they? No, they, they actually they knew Barbie though. <laughs> <laughs> How are the prostitutes? The prostitutes, I'm, I'm the winning prostitute. How's that? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, there oh he is. God. I don't have. Wow. Did I invite you to this meeting? Talk about yeah. Did. Mike Furtado, can you go get Mike? I don't have his number. I'll call him. That is live streamed. You are, that is on the internet, <laughs> which is where it goes. Oh, and that's one of the live streams. That's cameras? Yeah, that's Twitch. Yeah. That they can't hear. They, they no. cannot hear. They just soundtrack the. That's a good place. Yeah. Society. Like fuck it. Nine dollars with the tip. Ooh. Nine. Oh. So what's up? What is a what is a uh, a, a famous Frank? How many clients do you like work with at any given time? I mean, obviously us at all times. But how many how many clients do you have that are like Wormwood? Where it's just like at all times. <laughs> Because this is a legal it is. relationship. It is. We're not just a client. This is a relationship. Mm. Yeah. Because if I had a, if I was going through a divorce, I would just want a divorce. Just you, give me the divorce. I don't need a relationship. You, 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 to end the relationship. you go to my partner. <laughs> You're done. With it. In fact, my partner just got done doing two divorces today. Finished. Really? So. How much does a divorce go for? About uh, two thousand three. Two to three thousand. Yeah. That's reasonable. Sign me up. No, I'm just <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Huh? Let's talk about machines. This is another machine story. The company's name is but it will make his life easier if you, we don't say it constantly. Uh, uh, uh. We, have a, we have a pretty deep relationship with this company. We have purchased probably close to a million dollars of machinery from this company. We got a lemon. We got a lemon of, so it's a $200,000 machine, which you have been struggling with. This is our star witness right here, Frank. Okay. <laughs> this machine has since day one had errors, issues, problems. So I drafted an email to their CEO. Which which, you've already sent. Which I have sent. <laughs> You're welcome. And <laughs> <laughs> Wormwood purchased four machines. We experienced an enormous amount of issues with our machine. Despite the issues we face, Wormwood's growing company. We need to think of the future. The plan was for <laughs> to bring in a new machine to Wormwood, mm -hmm. install that new machine, also surface the machine that was giving us issues. And then, see, and I made this bold, so you know it's important. Then we had a major incident. That's legal. Yeah, underline it. Wow. Yeah. On Monday, our machine ejected a tool while running. Now that's bad, just to be clear. The ejected tool hit the table, broke into pieces, and shrapnel hit one of our operators. Yes. Yeah, no, that's actually quite Luckily, bad. it was not quite bad. Yeah, the operator was not injured. Mike made the decision to escalate this issue as it had become a safety issue and not just a production issue. Mike was invited to a video call with President, CEO, yeah. Big Boss. Big Boss stated that <laughs> took this safety incident extremely seriously and it was time to sub out the machine immediately. This machine is not exactly the same type of machine Wormwood currently owns. Wormwood will pay for the differences between the machines. So hey, send us the new machine. I know it's slightly different. We will pay for whatever differences there mm -hmm. are. That was my offer. It's like, look, just get us a new machine. Then we can talk, we can move from there. So there's a machine we know we could use. They don't want to send us that machine. They would say, want us to get us the exact one. We cannot replace your existing machine with a different model. There simply is no accounting or warranty mechanism to make that happen. And my response to his sort of punt was, mm. I will be contacting my lawyer. Can I have a mailing address to send legal correspondence to? How'd this go? 
You've done much worse. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, they've been totally radio silent. They have not responded to this at all. They are aware since December 1st when we started having this problem. We've been anywhere between twenty-five dollars to $35,000 short on what we usually make off that machine a week. I mean, th this, this hurts. And I don't want to use a machine that's potentially going to hurt somebody. We want them to replace it. You want to replace it yourself and never use this company again. Yeah, no shit. I mean, at this point, I think they should just give us a full refund. They should give a full refund and come get their fucking chunk of metal off our floor. Exactly. I can't possibly I read that. That is, <laughs> this is one sec, look. That's a trendy that, client privilege. That, that is <laughs> absolutely. Matt, return, what does it, what does that say? Return, exactly return, what you said. Man. To machine? Return to the machine. Oh wait, refund me go. dollars. Yeah. <laughs> so what's, how does, uh, how does damages work? Uh, uh, like well, refund well, is well, great. I think, I think that, well that's why I asked. Ian's fucking No, blood. like, <laughs> Ian's fucking no, going like, for it. It is First never all, work. If you, if you want a refund of a machine. Sure. And that's what you asked for. Guess what oh. you're not going to get? The refund. I yeah. Why yeah, exactly. aren't I going to get a refund? Because you, then you, you're negotiating. I'm bad at this. Okay. <laughs> you ask for more than you want. So basically we're gonna say, give us a refund, plus here's all the damages, give us all this money. Yeah, yeah. and you know, we're never gonna use your company again. Legally, hmm? they're in North Carolina. Is this a Massachusetts thing or is this a North Carolina thing? It would be Massachusetts law. Oh, then I had to look at the contract. Why, can the contract say that? Yes. What? Yes. Wait. That's so crazy. Wait. Most contracts give, have a jurisdiction. So then that in the warranty, the warranty is gonna say what the jurisdiction yeah, is. Yes, so we need the warranty and that contract, whatever, PO, whatever you have from them. Uh... We have heard back from, yeah. from their attorney. According to this, now that I brought up lawyers, now they're all friendly. They're like, oh yeah, well, actually we can sub out the machines. We can send you the new machine. And yeah, mm. yeah. So, apparently they have the ability. Magically. Magically. When you threaten lawsuits and <laughs> bad publicity. And you have an industrial accident. And the CEO told you on a video call he would do it. When all the stars align. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's the long and the short of it. Frank, what is your, uh, do you have any initial opinions on this? What I see here is very similar to what was um, discussed initially when you were talking about this. So it seems like a lot of the similarities that, um, What's that sign say there? That sign says, fuck you, Nick. But what's funny about it, there was actually a second sign. This also said, fuck you, Nick. And it was here. So it was like this. And then when Nick came in, Nick, show him what you did. Well, he took it down and it's... It was pretty funny. <laughs> it was pretty <laughs> And now you can't, really can't do anything about you can't, it. Yeah. You can't get it. So yeah, they're basically saying we will do what we originally agreed, said we would do on the video call. That's basically it, but there's a little, some details we probably should go over. Yeah, the one thing that jumped out is a little nickel and dimey is stuff that's often included with a machine, transportation from their facility to our facility, like yeah, trucking yeah. it there and rigging. They're asking us to pay for that stuff. It's about a $200,000 machine. I would love it if they would just pay us $200,000 and come and pick up their machine. Now they're not offering that. What they're offering is, a working machine. I just want to move forward. Yeah. I don't know how easily. Yeah, if we really wanted to push for a full refund and them take their machine back, I feel like there'd be a lot more Frank segments and it would take an awful long time to make that happen. A full refund would be great, but I don't want to go to war. I would love it if we didn't have to pay the rigging. That just feels nickel and dimey. Why are you gonna charge us for rigging for your fuck up? The only thing that matters right now is your customers and you're being able to get product out. Getting this machine in here with the other one will help you do that. You want this done, they want it done. So I think you get it done. So I would feel comfortable, hey, yep, we'll pay the 46 grand for the upgraded machine, but you guys have to eat all the costs, getting your old one out of here, dropping off the new one and setting it up. That's the main thing. We don't want to pay for moving the machine. You have a two week deadline. If you can't hit those, we want a refund, a full refund. Does that seem reasonable? Let's keep pushing. Yeah. Let's keep pushing. Take everything. We might as well. <laughs> Several days later. We got a answer for I have an email, a counter offer. Have you read it yet? No, I have not. Let's just do it now. As you'll see in the above, has agreed to pay for half of the shipping costs of the new machine. The rigging costs for the new machine will be borne by Wormwood. 
Hmm. Moved it a little bit, but not all the way. So what is the difference between the shipping and the rigging? Dale, what is the difference between shipping and rigging? What does this even mean? The shipping is the transport of the machine to the site. The rigging is like the actual picking, moving to a flatbed trailer, and bringing the other machine so, in. So the rigger just shows up with his forklift and the shipper shows up with the machine. If we're paying for all the rigging, but we would be so we're paying to take our machine off and put their machine on. That does seem icky. I just don't know how much I want to have a pissing contest. I say we accept. You, you're, you're, you're on team. You're, 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 you're on team. We're a bitch. <laughs> well, we want. We got a nice new machine, and we get to walk away. It would be the fastest. Oh, yeah, I'm kind of a dickhead. I kind of, <laughs> they put out their offer. We put out this offer. Instead of meeting halfway again, they met 25%. Right. You know right. I mean? They didn't. They didn't split everything. Yeah. They just split half of one of the things. Yeah. No, I'm with you. Yeah. And by the way, the only reason we got this far is because we started threatening lawsuits. I just want that to be clear. The only reason we got to the point where they're going to send us the new machine and pay any of this is because we fucking had to call a lawyer. Ian, you're always the wisest and the best person. What do you think? <laughs> ah. Let's pull the trigger. Let's move forward. I will give this to you, Mike. All we have to do is arrange a rigger, but a lot of this is going to be like the setup and the installation, all that stuff. Okay. Well, that's a resolution. That is a resolution. Yeah, nobody, oh, you nobody want to vote? Yes, deal. Want to I guess it's one, two, three, five. I guess it wouldn't matter. Oh, you no, wouldn't your matter. vote. What are you going to vote? Your vote might count first. I, I was going to vote to just move forward. There we it go. It doesn't matter, but. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> So you do business and family law? I do business and civil litigation. You do business and civil litigation. Your partner does family. I've done one divorce, my kid. Mine. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs>